Today we're exploring a new tool created by Lottie Files called Lottie Creator. And this has some really cool AI features that can help you create motion design or UI animation. Let's check out how this tool works. All right, so as I approach the tool, this is how everything looks with a little artboard, pre-built assets for you, some animatable assets that you can use. However, what we want to check today is called AI Prompt to Vector to begin with. Now, this tool enables you to define the kind of vector illustration you want. It could be an icon, a logo, and a human illustration. It could be anything. In this case, my favorite is to define a dog on a skateboard or any other vehicle. So a cute dog in a sports car, I can even give it a style. So if I want a logo, I can, I can tell it it's a logo. If it's an illustrated scene, it can be that as well. Now I'm gonna click on generate and it starts doing its work here. And as you can see, within a few seconds, it creates a custom illustration for me. I'm gonna click on this and it inserts my illustration right here. Now it isn't perfect. The dog is half inside the car, half outside the car, but it still works for now. Of course, a better prompt, a more detailed prompt would give better results for sure. Now, after we've generated our illustration or just dragged or dropped an illustration from the pre-made ones, for the AI tool that creates animations for you, there's something called Motion Copilot. I'm gonna go ahead and click on this Motion Copilot, which brings this nice little window right here. I'm just gonna drag and drop it. And here I can define or give a prompt on how I want the animation to be. A floating animation from the top to bottom like a leaf. You can give similes like floating like a leaf and it will understand how floating like a leaf looks like. So I'm gonna put this here, I'm gonna select the layer and I'm gonna click on this arrow button right here. It starts doing its magic as you can see here. And within 10 to 20 seconds, you see a preview of your little animation right here. And if you are happy with this animation, you can either replace the current animations you have or add this to your current layer. Now this works really well is because if I play this, it adds that little leaf floating like animation like we had discussed earlier. If I want a more complex animation, I can go from fast to complex or to even experimental. Now, these three types of animations will produce different results. If I select complex and type in something like pin into view like a spring, and as you can see, it has created sort of a spring animation for us as well. The more complex we want it to be, we can always select the complex mode here. And for my last magic trick, we have ring like a bell because this exactly is a bell. And voila, it starts ringing like a bell as it should. You can obviously speed up this animation by, by tinkering with these little keyframes right here. Just drag them closer to each other as you can see. And this will make the entire animation much, much faster. See, a much faster little ring animation that I've created using artificial intelligence. This is just the first version of Motion Copilot that they're producing. Imagine this gets to a point where you can create extremely complex multi-level animations for different layers, different scenes, and then build on that. This could compete with something like After Effects and AI features in After Effects. But this was Lottie Creator and its AI features. Hope you liked this video. If you did, a quick thumbs up is always appreciated. I will see you every week, same time, same place. Until next time, take care. God bless.